Okay, folks, so uh, the next part of this project is to uh, put a second coat on here. So let me go get my bucket and I'll mix up my mud. And because I have a head camera, you guys can actually see how I mix mud. Okay, so first things first, we need powder and I'm using 20 minute sheetrock mud, which means that once I add water, I'll have 20 minutes to mix it up and use it. I think that's about right. So let's go mix it up. This is completely done by feel, so you just kind of add water and go. Now, for the second and third coat, you want it to be thinner. That looks good. Now we'll wash this out. And there's our mud. Alexa, set a timer for 15 minutes. 15 minutes. Sorry. So now what we'll do is we'll transfer this into our um, oh gosh, I can't remember what this is called now. Anyway, we'll transfer the mud into this trough. I don't think that's its right name. And it will thicken over time because this chemically sets, it's similar to concrete. All right, now these go get cleaned off. So the main advantage to washing out the bucket when it's fresh is it's just much easier to do. Um, one of the things I've learned with this material is you need to be fastidious. If you cannot keep your tools clean, um, mud that you mix is not going to be your friend. So Alexa, time remaining. So we're doing pretty good. I'm only four minutes into this so far. And I'm not worried about this corner because again, I'm gonna put crown molding in here and that will deal with that. All right, I can't stand having this crap all over my hands, so I gotta go wash my hands real quick. Here, and then I'll go finish up the stairway and then I clean all this out. All right, so that's that in here and now I'm gonna go put some on the stairway. That's done. I thought, yeah, I've got a little divot here. And I really don't need to do that. I'm just being a perfectionist at this point. 
because that will blend in with texture. Now this, on the other hand, does need a second coat. here. All right, so you can see down here I have quite a bit of uh, mud that I spilled. It, it doesn't matter. It will scrape up very, very easily once um, it dries in about a day. It'll technically start to harden in 20 minutes, so I could really come back in an hour and scrape it up. So that is, um, that completes putting the second coat of mud on this sheetrock and on the stairway uh, patch job. I will sand this down, maybe put a third coat on it, and then the next step is to texture it. And um, I'll texture both pieces at once. Um, there's actually a little bit more sheetrock that I may try to taper in because it's going to burn. Uh, you know, I'm going to use up five gallons of texture material because that's how I mix it up. So when I mix it up, I, I want to get some good use out of it. So there is one more closet that I want to include in this. Um, so thanks for watching. Hope you found this interesting and amusing. Um, stay tuned for more of my videos. Make sure that you like my videos and you subscribe to my channel.